There we go. <laughs> that a girl. Make a mess, boo. Uh, hello, guys. Zuljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. I hope you guys are having a good day. Me and Punez, we doing all right. <laughs> we just doing the old pooping evolve thing. About to get busy with this fertilizer game. So I hope you guys are having a great day. Thank you all so much for all the awesome support on the ARC series, guys. As always, if you do enjoy the videos, make sure to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. So where I'm from, farmers get up early in the morning, tend to their animals, they tend to the farms. And guys, that's something that I've been neglecting. Out here in uh, Pooping Evolved, we get a little uh, we get a little crazy sometimes, and we forget about what's important. And poop is like one of the main staples of an important server community. And we have been neglecting the poop. Let me sh let me just show y'all what kind of shambles the farm is in right now. Paris, nothing. Not a dead gun plant on her back. Everything died. Let's go outside. Outside, vegetable plants, nothing. Not a dadgum thing. No plant species X up front to defend ourselves. Nothing on the right side. No, nothing. And then on top of that, I've been wanting a plant species X uh, set up on a Quetzal platform so that we can do the, uh, the unmentionable when a giga comes around. So... I really, really just need to step up my game and get some things started. I started moving some of my inventory. I'm getting all of my stuff out of here because this is technically, this is just going to be a, um, the, for the animals. That's, that's always was it, what it was intended for. I just lived in here for a long time. The workshop is going to be primary storage and then we can finally move to an aesthetic house. But that's quite a bit along the way. We really need to do some other stuff before then. So. The first thing I want to do is, well, I, actually, I'm going to grab a bunch of thatch off Timbaland here, and I'm going to kind of match up the forms. I'm trying to kind of, I'm going to try to get the forming thing going on. We have plant species X seeds. We got plenty of thatch that we can turn into fertilizer. Uh, we're going to fill everything up and and get that process going. I think it's important that. I kind of take some time to do this maintenance because I never take time to do it. <laughs> and you can, I can feel stuff starting to slip away with the whole Xbox release and stuff, which is by, kind of delayed, by the way. And that's one of the reasons that I, I thought I would take you guys through this. Um, the Xbox thing, we're, we're kind of trying to get a server situated. And right now it's just a little bit, uh, it's really a little, a little bit up in the air. I went to make a video on it yesterday and the, um, the server was not available. Uh, in fact, there were a bunch of other servers that were available, but they were all public and they were all full. I couldn't even log on to a public server. I would have had to do single player and I don't, I don't really want to do single player. Like I want to play with my friends. So that's, that's kind of how I roll. So anyway. We're waiting to, for that to get sorted. I'll tell you what, Punez, we're going to have to do some damage for you. I think I should just be able to do... There we go. <laughs> that a girl. Make a mess, boo. Uh, we're just we're trying to get the Xbox stuff online. And um, anyway, I hope that comes to pass because I'd like to play some more on Xbox. But for now... We really have an agenda on this server too. Look at all the mess right here. Okay, so what? You know, I've never really built a platform for um, the plant species X. A lot of people have been saying that there's. Um, I, I know there there's like the way that everybody builds platforms. <laughs> like I know that already. Uh, so I'm gonna have to probably mess around with that and just look at the design and get that done. Other than that, I think. As far as the layout of the forms go, like we had last time is pretty good. With the forming on one side and the rest of the stuff on the other, uh, I think that'll work out well. Let's do one, two, three. Let's go downstairs. I've got plenty of fertilizer set up. Uh, as far as the seedlings go, I'm pretty sure all the seeds that I need are going to be on my mammoth. I could get everything off Timberland already, so it's going to be okay. And I don't think that... 
Thank you, dear. <laughs> I don't think they would mind. My spino would mind. Guamahave would mind if I grab some strong Guamahave poop. Somebody was telling me in the comments that the next time I respect for superfood, I need to use focal chili. And I think that would be an awesome idea to get some really, really, really effective stuff. So I'm going to be doing some of that with the Quambulance too. I'm pretty sure I'm going to name it the Quambulance. That seemed like the Quetzal Ambulance. That seems like a pretty good deal. Uh, as far as naming conventions go. The poop stacks. It's crazy, man. I can't believe you're so good at poop balancing, Punez. All right. So we've got all that going on. Let's see what I need here. Let's grab some seeds off Timbaland. I think I should be able to gamma out too. Gamma. There we go. And put the map away. We don't need it. Okay. So let's see. Seeds. Uh, I could probably just do seed. Okay. We've got savor root seeds. We're going to grab one of those. Rock carrot seeds. Citronol seeds. Long grass seeds. As far as Tinto berries are concerned, I don't think I need to put any berries whatsoever. I really don't. Uh, Azul, Amberberry, Norco berry. Norcos might be kind of nice, but I don't think I don't think so. It's it's just less. It's it's not as effective as just going out and doing what I need to do with Timbaland. Okay, so right here we go on with Plant Species X. And then we're going to fill it up 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. So plant species X, it's good. We're seeded. That's cool. We're going to do another one right on top. Actually, let's do it right. I should do one right here. I don't even think I need one up front like that, but I'll probably do one anyway. So let's do like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let's get five more. Punez! Where you at, B? Come on, let's take a little drink. Duty calls again, darling. There we go. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Very, very good. 15. That's another one and a half. Um, and I think I'm only going to need three plant species X up front here. And we're probably going to do two more forms just on the sides. I'm also going to dismantle what we already have on top of Paris because Paris is not going to have that set up on her anymore. I don't know what I'm going to have on Paris, but I really don't need plant species X on a walking uh, creature. It's much better on flying. Okay. So we've got 10 on here we need to do. And we only need to put five in this one. All right. So we're good. So now the rest, it's, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That'll be three fertilizers for each plant type. Plus, I'm going to need a lot. I might as well bring Punez out here. Because I'm still going to put the plants where I did last time. They're going to be on this side of the barn here. So let's take her out. Come on, girly. <laughs> and I know it's kind of a run-of-the-mill episode, guys. But like I said, it's kind of necessary. And I figure I would just hang out with y'all and talk. Not every episode could be a blockbuster, unfortunately. Okay, let's see. Let's do this again. And get some poop going. Uh-oh. Did I just stop? I did. Ouch! My bad, baby. I didn't mean to do that. Where's the uh where's the stem berries going? Alright. Sorry about that. Okay, stem berries. Now, remote use. I use a macro just because it's it's a lot <laughs> it's a lot less noisy and easier than clicking all those times for you guys. Alright. There we go. Oh. Funes. Go up a little bit, baby. Let me get let me grab let me grab the nitrogen. Drax just joined the orc. Okay, so this is how we're gonna work this. We've already got citronol seeds in here. Fine. We'll do one, two, three. 
and then six. I think we can probably get away with moving these around. How I don't know how exactly this is going to work, but I think we need to do it like that instead. That way it uses that first. I don't really know if it works like that, but at any rate, that's going to grow really, really well like that. And tomorrow I'll have to check it again. Okay, rock carrot seeds, fine. We'll put the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we can actually put one more. And then one, two, three. There we go. That's good and fertilized. 214k fertilizer. 214,000 fertilizer is not that bad. Um, we're gonna need a couple more poops. Let's do the let's hit Funes up again, one more time, baby. I know this is I know it's nerve wracking. <laughs> Poor baby, <laughs> she's gonna be chapped after this is over. <laughs> oh, all right, but these two should set me up. So as far as this goes, this will be done. And I'll be able to make my delivery to DMAC, and we'll also be able to demolish those setups on the back of Paris and kind of put together a deal for the platform. Uh, let's see here. So, boom, boom. All right, now three fertilizers. I don't know why I don't just press T all the time, but that's just the way I do it. And, okay, and that's the long grass. Very good. So that should be enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then one, two, three. And we'll have fertilizer to kind of boost them up tomorrow. So it should be good. All right. Now. So everything is planted that we need. These are going to grow. I'm going to get a lot of vegetables from them. I already have some vegetables in the fridge. And now that I know about the spall timers with the Oki, it's probably going to be pretty darn good. So this is what we're going to do from here. Let's get on top of Paris. And I hope I should have plenty enough uh, weight on me to be able to do this. But I'm going to go ahead and demolish these. And this is going to give me a lot of the materials back. That I can just do a few more. Uh, I wonder if we can make these without a smithy. I hope so. <laughs> if not, well, I just have to put some stuff on Paris. I don't even think I have these um, learned crop. There we go. Unlearned, small, medium. Okay, so it doesn't require a smithy. That's good. And plot, craftables, large. We'll do one, two. Like that. Actually, we're going to make a few more. Or as many as we can from this. Um, because two of them is going to go out back. And that's going to go over here. I wonder if Punez will be able to take me anywhere. Sure will. I know I left some poop behind. There's poop everywhere right now. Okay. <laughs> so this is the place that I have so much trouble. It's right here. So if I were to set up... A plant species X turret like here and here, I think that would be pretty good. You see that darn uh, that darn snake right there? That's gonna be the death of me. They never really come up here, so I could put them down here, I suppose. But let's see, what would happen if I would take one of the plots and try to place it, let's say, right here? It would probably work out pretty good. Ouch! See? That's why I need my darn plant species X down here. Come back here. No, you're not getting Funes. Funes has a job to do. You can't knock her out. She is busy today. She's booked up. Oh, now what? Oh, is that a Dimorphodon? Why are you attacking me, Dimorphodon? I didn't do nothing. I might have swung at you by accident or something like that. You should have had enough sense to know it was just a snake that I was after. Okay. Let's put a second plant species X turret here. Okay, and that ought to be fine. And we'll kind of do the same thing. I know they aren't watered, but they, plant species eggs don't really need to be irrigated. They really don't. Uh, it should be fine. 
Okay, so we'll do plant species X seed and one, two, three, four, five, six. What's did I just see? Oh, that's another Fiomi. I saw something running out the corner of my eye. I kind of freaked out for a minute there. Okay, let's see. One more load of nitrogen. Thank you for your services, Punez. I hope you don't get a rash. I don't need my pick for this. This is going to be one crappy episode, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I had to. <laughs> All right. There we go. Are you going to... Dang it. Okay, I could jump right over the rails. That's cool. I didn't even realize that. Okay, cool. I got that situated now. Uh, let's do one, two, three, four, and we're gonna have to put the water in to get this really started. Um, actually, you know what? I might as well just do it with the canteen remote use. That'll give it a little bit of water to at least start the process, I think. Yeah, there we go. And honestly, I should just probably just refill my water right quick. I'll take these and put my canteen in too and that ought to give me enough water to set that up it's really not hard once you fill up a crop plot it's pretty good the rain just keeps it up from there okay uh, let's take one of these out and remote use and remote use and one more time remote use. Alright, there we go. So we should be full on water there. And over here, we'll kind of do the same thing. We'll take the plant species X. Where about put it? And then the poop. And remote use. Remote use three times. There we go. All right, now how much water do they have here? They have four out of 600 water. Could probably use a couple more doses, but other than that, we'll see. The water's not going down real fast. If it doesn't rain by the time I finish the episode, well, I'll just probably come remote use again. All right, it shouldn't be a problem. Let's put these water skins up right quick. I wish this tap was a little lower so I didn't have to drink, uh, so I didn't have to jump to drink. All right. And I'll just drink. There we go. Uh, I should have just did my canteen too, huh? Bam. Done. Okay. Uh, get in my inventory. Okay. Now. Now we have to do a Quetzal with some forming plots here. So, what do I need for form plots again? We said... Plot. Plots take 100 stone, 80 wood, thatch, and fiber. I have plenty of thatch and fiber, and I should have enough stone. How much? You know what? I think I used most of my stone, to tell you the truth. Yeah. Rocksteady used most of the stone. Okay, let's go for a quick stone run. Uh, I'm going to go for the river rocks that I always go to right out here. It's going to be nice to get set up again. I'm going to be protected. It, you'd, you'd be surprised how codependent you are on Plant Species X when you get around it and they aren't there anymore. Like you kind of depend on it and then it isn't there anymore. It really sucks. That was a pretty frog. Okay, I see a, a gator waiting over here. Oh, they're, they're preoccupied. I won't be long, guys. Don't mind me. Just gathering some rocks. Six hundred and twenty-six. Ouch. This is gonna kinda hurt. Wow. <laughs> I need to go get my frog for right here. 
Get me out of here. Okay. I think I should be able to get out now. Oh no. I'm lost. Neutral. Get him, Rock. Get him, Rock Steady. I need, I need my frog. I cannot miss out on all that cementing paste. Did y'all see that? It's ridiculous. One of my frogs ought to do. Rocksteady's gonna be just fine. If not, he'll ball up. All right, let's go. Yeah, that's cementing paste. I don't need it for anything right now, but I will. Look at the carnage that stayed behind. Okay. Where's all of them now? Where'd they all go? Oh, I'm not believing this. There was freaking... There was bugs everywhere. Oh, here they are. You just can't see them, really. There's one. <laughs> I thought there was a lot more. It seemed like a lot more than that, that's for sure. Okay. Any more that I missed? No? Okay. <laughs> Come on, Rocksteady. Oh, you're still full, aren't you? Let me grab some of that stone off you. There we go. Now you're ready to go, huh? Let's go. We got stuff. Oh. <laughs> Alright, fine. A chaffalaya. <laughs> We're all just gonna walk home. I don't need you guys' as mounts. I'll just walk. Let's go, though. Dang, man. Managing the herd. Come on, Rocksteady. What are you doing back there? Let's go. I got stuff to do? Okay. So Timbaland has plenty of wood on him. Because I just went out and grabbed some wood earlier. And I'm going to need to use that to make the farming plots. Where is Rocksteady? Rocksteady's just taking his sweet time. We'll be alright. Okay. Bien wa. Let's grab... That's come see in French, by the way. Okay. I think I have enough thatch and stuff, but I'll grab some just in case. Thatch. And what was it? Fiber, too? I believe there was plenty of fiber. Yeah. Plenty of fiber. Okay. So let's do plots. One, two, three. And the rest will be in rocks that I need, which Rocksteady should be back with that really soon. Where is he at? Oh, he's trying to get in from there. Hold on a Chafalaya. You could stay there. Okay, we got a few hundred. I'm still encumbered like a boss, though. Can I make another crop lot right quick? Uh, no. Still need... What, do I, what am I missing? Ah, wood. Okay. Dang it. <laughs> Come on, Rocksteady. I'm getting thirsty and stuff on the job. Tim Plan, come here. <laughs> so heavy right now. Ah, perfect. Okay. <laughs> Let's get a couple stacks of wood in here. And I should just be able to finish up with crop plots. There's three more. I don't know how much stone it takes per. Now I can move again. Let's move two more stacks. And I'll do one, two. And I'm pretty sure I'll need wood after that again. Which I should have enough with that. That's a lot of plant species. I should be able to be just fine. Now, I don't want a huge platform on that plant species either. Because of the fact that I, I see people, they have a hard time driving them. 
And I know there's like really, really good ways. I'm so full of stuff right now. There's really, really good ways to do it. Okay. How much do those things weigh? They're only 36. How about this? Rocksteady, we're going to move like berries on you. Can I move on you now? Yeah, sure can. All right, Rock. Go sit up here. You've got plenty of stone on you if we need it. We'll come back to it. And... Might as well grab the poop, too. You know I'll need it sooner or later right now. Okay, and can I move at all on a Chafalaya? Chafala... Cha... A Chafala... There we go. <laughs> okay. We got some cementing paste from that. That's pretty good. All right. So those crop plots are getting irrigated right now. Oh, uh, Rocksteady, we don't we don't stop. We good. My frog's not following me. I told that to stop. Okay, good. What level is this guy? 48? No. Or gal, I should say. Okay, so now I have to go on top. Let's close this door. I'm going to go on top and grab one of the... Uh, platform saddled birds one of the Quetzals Quetzal right here has a platform saddle I have two of them but that Quetzal does not have a um, does not have a current does not have a current platform saddle on it so I'm just gonna take this one for now actually you know what that's a Quetzal egg. I want that for sure. And then I want the Quetzal to have... I want the... I want the lower level Quetzal to have the platform. I know that might not make sense, but let's see. 10,200 health. This is one of the higher level Quetzals that I have. While this one, on the other hand, is... Well, 10-2, 136, stamina 1650. What's different about these two? Stamina 2250. Ah, the stamina is much higher on this. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and keep the platform saddle on it. I think that'll be just be the better deal. I don't know what I'm going to pump yet or what I'll need or anything, but Archangel, you can come back down. So I don't know what I'm going to level yet, but it should be fine. Okay. Okay. Now, Orc. You can come on back in the house. Excuse me, Timberlands, but... Okay. Alright, now as far as foundations go on this thing, I know everybody does like that 4x4 four four deal, you know? And the way that they do it, I think, is stone foundations and then they attach ceilings and stuff. But I don't I don't think I want to do that. I think I want to kind of do it like I did. they did Paris. So let's see. I might just do... Let's see. The, probably the more the merrier, though, on this thing, honestly. So let's see, I got 15 ceilings right now. I could probably just do some thatch roofs to do what I need to do and attach them. These are large crop plots. I might as well put those in as well. So I'll need some thatch ceilings and some stone foundations is probably what I'm going to need. I don't really need stone foundations either. I could probably do wood foundations. Let's see what Timberland has on him. Because nothing's ever going to hit this thing. I mean, it's possible that it gets hit, but I don't think I have any more logs on me. No, I'm going to have to go grab some more logs for that. All right. Let me go get a little bit more work done, guys, and I'll be back. Guys, I got a basic layout made, and I wanted to get it to where it was big, but not too big. And I think this is, can support plenty of plant turrets. It should be fine. So the, the general consensus here is two of the platforms, just so I can have a little bit of space to get on and off right here. And we have four ceilings on either side with one in the back. So 
pretty cool setup here and I've got enough stone things to do it like this I think let's see eight nine yeah I sure have enough so I should just be able to demolish these and a lot of that is gonna go with it but that's okay all right and now we can put the stone foundations down so let's see we want to go back I want to get it to where it's lined up so I always mess this up too <laughs> because the Quetzal moves it's a little bit hard to make it pretty I guess I should say so let me line the Quetzal platform up with the top of my screen when it's at full extension like so and then we'll press the 7 button uh, not L K and then let's see here uh-huh that does not look lined up <laughs> even though even though it looked like it from the beginning that looks a little bit more lined up is the side even that's what I gotta see if the sides even no, not still not quite probably a little bit to the left just like that and now if I were to push it yeah the sides pretty much even now okay so now I'm dead on so now I could just go back a little bit that's about the furthest back as I can get it. Like that. Okay, got it. <laughs> now that it's straight, I can just attach on to it. Okay, there's two, and I still have plenty of room up here. All right, here comes the fun part. We'll go with a ceiling on the back, and I know you could do some stuff with platforms, but I really don't know how, like attaching. I thought you can just go from underneath the ceilings and attach, but it wouldn't let me, so I don't know what the deal is with that. All right, but like I said, this is plenty big enough too. All right, so now I have room on all of these things for plant species X turrets and large crop plots. So let's lay the large crop plots down. I should just let me place on all of them here. Uh, let's see here, eight. Uh, a little bit iffy right there. There we go. <laughs> um, all right. And this is Operation Giga Protection, pretty much. That way I can help defend. Because when, like, Giga's tearing apart stuff like they did the other day, me and XB is going to have to get together and, uh, and rebuild our entire deal. <gasps> Punez got killed by a titan boa? What? No, Punez. Where is she? Oh, no. How did that even happen? Oh, Punez. I left Punez out here. I can't believe this stupid titan boa. Oh, you going down. A 104. Man. Funes was a good Fiomia, y'all. She deserved better. I'm going to take her saddle and the last bit of her stem berries. Poor thing. She pooped until she couldn't poop anymore. And then she finally pooped out. Oh, poor Funes. We're going to have to get another one now. I can't believe that was so bad. I can't believe I left her out like that. Okay, well, let's finish the job. She wouldn't she would have wanted us <laughs> she would have wanted us to finish. Okay. Now what am I going to do for more fertilizer, man? I'm going to have to get another one to finish up the fertilizer for it to get the plant species X online. Okay. 8 There we go. All right. And I guess I could put one more back here, but I would rather be able to turn them all off. So I think I'm just going to keep this spot open for now. Ah. <laughs> now to fill them up. This is going to be <laughs> my new Fiomia. 
There's a wild female level 40 right here. I'm going to go ahead and trank it. I'm going to call her Crot. <laughs> because that's that's a lot of Cajuns say that's what you do. You crot in your pants. <laughs> All right. Let's let's go ahead and put the Mejos on her. How fast is she going to eat him? And how fast is she going to tame out? It's not going to be super quick, I don't suppose. She does eat fast, though. <laughs> Maybe so. Okay, so while this is happening, I'll show you all what I got. I do have pretty much, and it's foggy, naturally. All of my, uh, all of the plant turrets are there. Everything is placed. Now all I really have to do is finish seeding it and uh, put some more fertilizer in, which I'm going to wait on the Fiomia for that, and then naturally let it water out. The, uh, it's going to have to rain first. Uh, because these don't have seeds in them, so we'll just do that. And we do have a few pieces that we can start it with. That way, in case it starts raining, we'll have a little bit of fertilizer in there already. Uh, let's see. And like so. And like so. And the others have some in it already. This one... Has that already with a few in it already? Cool. Okay, let's go. Let's go over here and check on the Fiomia and wait until the fog lifts. All right, guys. Crot is almost tamed. Rip Funes. <laughs> let's go ahead and label it. I don't know how to spell Crot either, so I'm gonna just spell it like this. Well. It could be U A T, Crot, and we'll put a uh, let's put an accent mark right there. <laughs> that way, that way you'll know that it's not what it looks like, like kraut or sauerkraut or whatever. Uh, come on, Crot, let's put you a, uh, a saddle on. There we go. Now let's see if you can live up to your your position. Uh huh. Yeah, you can lay out a few turrets quick. That's exactly what we needed from you. You hard. Welcome to the family. <laughs> oh, man. All right. So now... Excuse me? Am I too heavy for you? Oh, man. Your weight stat. 228. What is my weight right now? I do have a lot of stuff on me. All right. I can always grab it with the Quetzal, though. I don't know what I'm going to name this Quetzal, either. Uh, it's going to have to be something that's... Oh, wait. Let me drink. It's going to have to be something that's related to the plants, I guess. Um... Is she a female? I hope so. Female, yeah. I don't know. I could name it Ivy, like Poison Ivy or whatever. That might be pretty cool. <laughs> All right. Let's do... I'm going to need at least a few more pieces. And it's going to need a rain in order to irrigate this. Because I'm not going to remote use water on everything. But it should be all right. Uh, we need one more piece of fertilizer. Yeah, and there it is. <laughs> oh, gosh. That's all we needed to do. Oh, where is it at? God, dog, I got bouncy poop. I knew I shouldn't have ate them jumping jelly beans. Come on, poop. Oh, my gosh. I'm never going to be... I got it. I got it. I got the poop. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I'm going to grab Krot, and we're going to get back to the born. Come on, Krot. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the little video. I know it was pretty maintenance-wise, but it all has to be done every once in a while. But I really hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos, guys. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off. And we'll see you next time. Can I get uh, some cream and some uh, some Splendor, please? You see him and Travis talking. Doc, I can't drink this oh, black. So that's why Spike's in a hurry. <laughs> Got this is too strong. Can, in a man. Robin, Tonight, can I get some uh, you can show sugar, us what you really made of. cream and yeah, yeah. yeah. All right.